but afterwards, I feel like if we go to every city, we might even come across a few new ones that we didn't see before. So we'll go check out the different cities as well. Oh, hello there. I didn't even notice you were outside. I was so busy raiding Lady things down. Giselle, how much longer until the roads are reopened? At this rate, we won't be able to stay in business much longer. Please, everyone calm down. The guards have been shaken by all the instability. They've retreated to Fort Gondala and put it on lockdown. I've been trying to reach the military headquarters, but I haven't been able to establish contact yet. We don't have time to wait. Our losses are already catastrophic. If we don't do something soon, Sherilton will be doomed. I... I'll do something. I promise. If only Lord Klein were still here. Uh, stop bullying Giselle! Ellie, Rowan, you're all here. Yeah, we just got back we from the other world. Over here. A little bit of jet lag. Perhaps we can be of some assistance. No, this is something I need to handle myself. It's my duty as Klein's successor. Your determination is laudable, but you are slightly mistaken. Not you two! I know I'm not capable enough, but I still have to try. We know you're doing your best, my lady. We do. However, this isn't just about business anymore. With the roads shut down, there are people who are struggling merely to survive. Can Rowan come up with a plan to fix this, maybe? Then it seems our only option is to invade Fort Gondala. What? But what about the golems that protect it? I thought they were invincible. Yes. Within the right spirit climb, a golem's defense power is absolute. However... In the wrong spirit climb, their defensive power would be diminished. Correct. And we now know of a way to change a spirit climb ourselves. We do, we do, so that's we true. Use a booster like they did at Fezabel Marsh, we, we stand a real chance at victory. The spirit climb of the area. So if we just need a booster, why not use the same one we used at Fezabel Marsh? I'm afraid it was swept away by the marsh flow. Well, that's mighty what convenient. What about Tipo? Tipo is a special type. I'm afraid we couldn't use him for this. We'll need to find a different booster. I'm so sorry to have failed you! <laughs> Wait! Mila! Remember when they captured Tipo at Fort Gandala? That's right. Noctical was conducting booster experiments right there at the fort. There should be plenty of boosters within its confinements. And if we can get our hands on one, we can take out the golems. So the key that we need to break into the fort is hidden within the fort itself. <laughs> oh dear. We certainly have our work cut out for us. We'll be going there anyway. This way we kill two birds with one stone. But I can't expose you all to danger, just for the sake of my city. You're mistaken again. Your determination should be used precisely for that purpose. Lady Drissel, each of us has our own role to play. For a governor, it's showing your people the right path, and taking responsibility for those who walk it. You're... you're right. Now, Lady Drissel of House Cheryl, we await your order. Very well. As the new governor, I hereby ask you to retake Fort Gondala. For the good of Sherilton. Yes, my lady. Leave it to us! It's not like we have to save the world or anything. We couldn't save the world afterwards, we gotta save it first. Okay, well that seems like a good place for us to go next. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head there next, but first let's go check out the naturalist over here and see if he's got anything cool to say. Like, hello, I've done cool things, and I've gotten a research grant from the government, so you can have half of the money or something cool like that. Please? I just want some money, man. Even though I've got a lot of it anyway. Hello there. How you doing? Ah, uh, hello there. I've got the results of the examination data. So the art we used at Bermia Gorge came in handy, huh? Oh, yes. Now, after reviewing all of the data... I have determined that there is a clear link between spirit art usage and nearby spirit climb changes. As the scale of spirit art usage grows, the changes in the climb become more pronounced. So the recent topographical changes in Bermia Gorge are due to the increased spirit art usage in Sheraton. That's right. I saw the same kind of data with Fenmont's expanding night climb as well. 
At our current usage scale, we should only see minor alterations. But if we keep developing new spirit arts, we may be facing irreversible changes to our spirit climbs. Like the whole world going dark? That is a remote possibility, yes. So even if we stay inside the schism, there's a chance that Reason Maxia could end up just like Olympias. Oh. I guess even spirit arts have their drawbacks. All the more reason to go for Spyrexes, I guess. Unless that can't solve the problem either. It all depends on how we use them. If all we seek from spirit arts or Spyrex is to maximize convenience, then of course we'll see repercussions. I agree. But at least this news comes at the right time. Yeah, if we open the schism and reshape the world, surely human awareness will be reshaped as well. The question, of course, is in what way? But nothing will change at all if we don't act. You're right. For better or worse, this is the path we've chosen. So don't use spirit arts like a madman and use them... Use them with responsibility. Okay, so anyway, now we need to head to Fort Gandala. It would be the dungeon. Derp, derp, derp. We'll go that way. Don't think it really matters much. So we need to get the boosters inside the place so we can alter the spirit climb so we can fight the golems. Oh, I didn't see anybody over there. There's not a whole party of people hiding behind that big rock. Why would they have guards out if the golems are functional? No one is able to feel fully secure once fear has overtaken them. This should work to our advantage. Perhaps we can convince them to tell us where the boosters are kept. Devious! Do this right and we'll be done in a flash. Excuse me, could you tell us where your supply of boosters are? Or do we have to beat it out of you? Guess we have to beat it out of you. the golems this way, you know. Who said anything about deactivation? We're going to destroy them! You're kidding, right? Jokes were never my strong suit. Uh... Would you be so kind as to tell us where the boosters are kept? They... They should be in control room 02. Do we know where that is? It's a spare control room located opposite from the one we visited earlier. Got it. Let's go. Okay, so we're looking for control room 02. Considering that we have seen pretty much most of the fort already, and I'm sure there's probably monsters. Hey look, it's the golems. Let's sneak into Fort Gondala and try to find a booster. That seems to be our only hope of defeating the golems. True that. Um, since we've seen most of the fort already, I'm just gonna go look for it off camera and I'll come back whenever I actually find the thing. Okay, I think this is it. Control room 2. It's on the opposite side of the facility as the first one. So if we go down here, hopefully these people can, uh, quote-unquote, help us find where the boosters are kept. Here we go. Boosters. Ah, this is indeed the same type of booster that was used at Fezabel Marsh. If we can use this to change the spirit climb, the golem's defensive power should plummet. Kind of like a golem inhibitor. Hey, a golem inhibitor! <laughs> do you even know what that a golem means? Golem inhibitor. Not a clue. So how do we use it? Leave that to me. Very well. Then let's crush some golems. Let's crush some golems. Okay. Where does this go? The Great Golem Reckoning. The golems should be guarding the gate to the main passageway. Now we shall put an end to them. Yep, let's let's do that. And that sealed shut and won't open. Um, we can save just a tiny bit of time here by just telling us to quick travel back to Fort Kandala and then we'll be right outside the door that we need to be going to. And uh We'll fight these guys and we're going to end the episode. It looks like it's going to be probably another episode of doing these type of things. Where we fight... Fight things Two and look at people. Ahead. Do we have more golems? And two more behind us! Uh-oh. Four golems at once. Truly a rock and a hard place. Yeah. No. 
It's four birds with one stone. They've saved us the trouble of hunting them down. <laughs> <laughs> it's impossible to get discouraged with Mila around. Agreed. We're much stronger than we were before. Let's do this. You said it. Rowan. On it. Activating the Golem Inhibitor. The Golem Inhibitor. Okay. So one of them's weak to fire and one of them's weak to water. Let's take out the one that's weak to fire first. And yeah, we'll do that. Guys, it's looking mighty tough. It's Roshagal's ultimate defense weapon. It's oh, not wow. something we'd normally stand a chance against. But we might stand a chance now. Keyword, might. We ran away from it once, but not now. That's right. It's payback time. Thank you. We'll be okay as long as we can take one out first before we get damaged too much. We're okay. We're okay. Oh. Ow. There we go. We're fine. Ow. We just have to, just have to get the fire, the one that's weak to fire first. Maybe some steel. Ow. Don't worry, I'm here with you. Yeah, we'll, we'll be okay. We just have to just have to do a lot of guarding, maybe. That might help. And keep attacking the one. If we get it down to one, then we get to stun lock the crap out of them. But because there's two, we can't really stun lock them very well. Oh, oh, that that took me down. Oh. See what he's at. He's about half health. A little less than half, actually. Ow. Ow. No, no, no. Great healer! Let's do this. Got it. We're okay. We're okay. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Yep. Still losing health. I mean, we are too. So be good not to die. Oh yeah, that's gonna do some damage. I think I do have a... I can't remember how it goes, so let's look at it before I do this. I do have a really good fire uh, art thing. A fire uh, link that I can do with Mila. What is it? Flame ring? Or flame spear. Yeah, that's it. So it's steel plus flame ring. I think is how it goes. Yeah, so we'll do that. Let me link up with her and then we'll start fighting. Ow. I need people closer to me for that to be effective. And there we go. I'm glad I actually did it right that time. Okay. Oh, we're so close. We just gotta finish him right here. There we go. Now with one left, he won't be nearly as bad. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, we gotta... Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is bad. Let's bring Rowan in. We're gonna replace. Gonna replace Mila with Rowan. Because I know he has water spells that'll help us out. 
Having two mages is definitely useful in this battle, though. Ow. Oh, oh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Oh, I can't do anything. Okay. And she should be able to, yeah, bring everyone up. Uh, she needs something. We'll give her... We'll give her a lemon gel. Ow. Ow. I guess, I guess we really do have to fight for them. I didn't expect more of them to settle them out of battle. Now, that move isn't even that strong, honestly. Not good. Don't worry, I'm here with you. Wake up! Please provide support. Don't worry. The pride of the ancients and erupt in time. We're okay. Quite a predicament. You'll be okay. Now, that's one. There we go. All those, uh, all those buffs are really helping us out, I can tell. Like, all of those, uh, life buffs and the item buffs that we have are really helping out a lot. Oh, I'm gonna die. There we go. Oh, now recall brought him back. That's good. There we go. I feel like we're gonna get some nice GP after this. We'll probably level like once or twice per person. This guy's almost dead, I think. Yeah. Okay, so we're back to one that's weak to fire again, so let's keep attacking him. Let's do this. Got it! I didn't expect this battle to be this brutal. Time for a duet! Okay! There we go. Run away. Here, I'll distract him. You revive him. There we go. Ow. We just have to keep, like, retreating to heal. No, I bet if we had better resistances, this would be easier as well. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that one. Ah, dang it. I wanted to finish that off. Oh well. Let's have to punch him a bunch. Oh, she managed to uh to backstep though. There we go. And there we go. What do you got now, big guy? Oh, you don't got that much more health. This is good. 
Ah, uh, dang it, she always does that right when I'm wanting to do it. There we go. Yeah, with just one left, he's not going to be a problem at all. There we go. That was really close. That was that was pretty brutal, but I liked that battle a lot. Got a blue cape and a red cape. Let's check those out after this. Yes, all right. I can't stop. I want to get stronger. All right. Never stop improving. All right. Not bad. I need more strength. But everyone did level up, so that's cool as well. Four golems down. I thought the golems were invincible. How did this happen? We used magic. Rashikal is done for. Is that all you have to say after holding yourselves up here without permission? You should be ashamed. We were doing it for our country. Rashikal's military assets must be protected. Do you truly believe that abandoning the citizens you serve strengthens your country? I... well... Wait. Are you Chief of Staff Hilbert? No, but I used to be. You all are the military of today. And as such, it is your duty to figure out what needs to be done. Understood. The Fort Gondola Guards will reopen the fort immediately. Good work, soldiers. We will resume patrolling the high roads and protecting civilian activities. That takes care of that. That should be a load off your cell shoulders. Yeah, go. And we've made it through Fort Gondola at last. Yeah, what an ordeal. Yeah, golems are. I have no excuse for my people. performance. Age. No, you're just a squishy character. You can't apologize for being a squishy character. Sharing the good news. Let's get back to Dressel. We have to tell her how great you were. Um. Yeah, let's do it really quick. Just right at the end, just to tie this up and hopefully have nothing else to worry about. So let's just finish that up really quick and then we'll end the episode here and uh, we'll continue on our adventures in the next one. Drissel, we solved the problem. We beat up some really ginormous golems. They almost kicked our butt, but we, uh, we, we kicked theirs first. Like, they really did kick our butt. I think if it wasn't for the fact that we had two healing or re uh, reviving Thank mages goodness, in battle... Made it back. Is anyone hurt? It would have been more difficult. We're fine, my lady. As you can see, we couldn't be healthier. We kicked ten tons of golem butt! Oh, I'm so relieved. You are worried about us? Of course. I don't know what I would have done if you had gotten hurt on my behalf. We got very hurt, Facing but we did that pain do is it. one of the gravest duties of leadership. It sure isn't easy. No, it is not. But as long as you feel pain at the suffering of your people, they will always be there to support you. I'll do my best, just as Klein did. It might be difficult, but we know you can do it. I'm sorry I can't give you the rewards you deserve. Wait, I know. I'll brew up some of my finest tea. Come, let's have a tea party. A tea party right before <laughs> the end of the world. I couldn't ask for a finer reward. Throw in some of those little cakes and you've got a deal! Tipa knows where it's at. We want the cakes. Okay, so we got a skill tome. Let's see, what does that skill tome do for us? A tome that grants Rowan access to the anti-magic skill. Ooh, let's go look at that. Anti-magic skill. All arts used on you will have no effect. Okay, so... So this is like I was worried about before. So any arts that are used on him cannot affect him at all, including ones that we are trying to buff him with. Um, I'm going to keep that off just because, first off, he doesn't get hit with a lot of arts. Usually it's melee attacks are what's going to do him in. But other than that, uh, it would be useful. But yeah. Anyway, 
So this is where we're going to stop for today. I'm about halfway through my list. Uh, we've got a few more things, like we need to go to Fezbell Marsh, we need to talk to Wingle, um, we need to go to the medical school and talk to Prim. So we will resume those next episode. So thank you guys for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for more Tales of Exilia. Bye!